here's the first page. Okay. Paul was sent. There's a picture of sin. You notice how on the very first page I've established dramatic tension. You know, I mean the reader is immediately drawn in. You know, he, he, the reader wonders what's gonna happen next, you know? What would make a grown man cry? Okay. He didn't have any money to buy his grandchildren Christmas presents. Aww. Aww. That's so sad. How can I get money? <laughs> How can I get some money, Paul asked Ma. That's a question you should ask God, said Ma. <laughs> God says in James 4, 2, that ye have not because ye ask not. So you should ask God for money. <laughs> That's right, Ma, said Pa. You are a wise woman. <laughs> that night, Pa asked God for money to buy Christmas presents. And there's a picture of Pa with his prayer partner right there. <laughs> <laughs> the next morning, Ma asked, Did God answer your prayer last night, Pa? No. I didn't hear anything, said Pa. Ma said, Pa, don't you remember we speak to God when we pray, but He speaks to us in His Word, the Bible. You need to read your Bible to hear God talk to you. You're right, Ma, said Pa. You are a very wise woman. Yeah. <laughs> pa read his Bible. He read it, the, the print gets smaller, the book gets longer. <laughs> Paul read in Proverbs 27, 23, Be thou diligent to know the state of thy flocks. No. That's the ticket, cried Paul. God is telling me to raise a flock of chickens and sell the eggs to get ready to buy presents. God is speaking to me. <laughs> Man, this book just gets better and better. First Paul built a chicken pen. Then he got some chicken feed and chicken waters. Then one day the baby chicks came. Oh, yeah. Paul was a good chicken farmer. The chickens liked him. One chicken sat on his shoulder. Some chickens would even hop on his back. <laughs> Next, Paul built a chicken house, <clears throat> such as it is. <laughs> the hens quickly learned to go in the chicken house to sleep on the roots. Paul built nest boxes on the side of the chicken house. Mm -hmm. See, that's where they lay their eggs. Right there. Every day, Paul checked to see if there were any eggs in the nest. On the day the chickens were four months old, Paul found an egg. He was so excited. The next day, there's the egg right here. <laughs> the next day there were two eggs. The next day there were three eggs. Soon all the hens were laying eggs. Now Paul could sell the eggs and get some money. It was almost Christmas time. All of Paul's grandchildren came to Ma and Pa's house. Pa decided it would be a good time to send his grandchildren down and have a serious talk with them. What would you children like to be when you grow up, asked Paul. All of the children shouted, We all want to be chicken farmers like you, Pa! <laughs> There they are. Paul smiled. Guess what he got them for Christmas? Chicken. 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 